<laughs> We're going yellow tailing. Maybe tuna fishing, maybe king fishing. We're gonna try and catch Renzo one of everything in the sea. Probably not gonna happen, but we're gonna have a good day. A couple beers in the cooler, a couple baits in the cooler, a couple good times in the cooler. Not really, but there's gonna be. There's gonna be some fish to eat. I'm ready for it. We're gonna smoke them. Gonna be a good day. A lot of boats going out today. We got Tony. He's gonna get a Wahoo probably. Nickname Wahoo Tony. We'll see you in a little bit. Gotta get anchored up, find the yellowtails. right there but maybe not yellowtails we'll find them there we are gonna be them oh he just let go right there oh no he didn't swimming check on the measuring board. Yep, see you later. Close. Real close. Target species. Gotta get bigger ones. Renzo, tight already. What do you got, dude? Quick. There we go. That was really quick. Oh, nice yellowtail. There you go. Pop them up. <laughs> that might actually be a keeper. Close. Let's see. Damn, that was an instant bite. The 12. Ooh, oh, we're good to go. Good. 13. There we go. First one on the board. Finally. Oh. <laughs> Straight into the jump bucket. <laughs> Damn. Oh, right. this is a yellow tail, dude. If this is, it's a big one. This is a big one. Come on. Oh, it's a nice one. Heck yeah. Oh, no. 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 Dude, oh. that was a nice one too. I saw him. Got him on. All right, this one's a lot smaller, but target species. Still a keeper. Hey, heck yeah. There we go. That'll work. Right spot. Hmm? Take the right spot. Yeah, we did. Glad that we moved. Good to go. Thirteen. Two. Ooh, yeah. Gotta take this one light, dude. I do not want to lose it. Do not want to lose it like the last one. Might be a big mangrove here.
Oh man, it's a nice fish. <laughs> Could be the same one. Coming up. Oh, oh. giant mangrove. Oh my gosh. Oh no! 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 Gosh, I need a net! <laughs> I don't have a net! Why did I try and wrap that? Oh. Giant mangrove! Oh yeah, that other one was definitely a mangrove too. And I need to figure out. Alright, I got this bait net. If we get another one, dude, done. Yeah. gonna have to use this. All right. Dang, dude, that's a, oh, man, that was a probably like a three pound mangrove, which is like, that thing was 20 inches for sure. That thing is 10 times better eating than these yellowtail. It's all right, we'll get another one, like you said, man. Glad we moved spots though, huh? I'm like shaking tying this knot because I'm still adrenaline. That was a stud. Huh? No, it's a yellow tail the way it's sliding. Yep. There you go. That's a keeper. So those will slide like that, you know, you can just crank and crank and crank. The mangroves are going to dig. Gonna go deep. Yeah. yeah. There we go. Pro trace. It's yellowtail time, folks. Snap, the snapper slapper, Renzo. What do you think call it? Dude, us getting a mangrove that size into that net right there is gonna be a show in itself. It'll be worth it. <laughs> it's not gonna work out too well. The mono will probably run out a lot faster on you than the braid, so you'll just have to get used to it, but you'll tell when there's a fish. It's like a, a hard run. Yellow tail, sliding. Digging a little bit, and he got him. Yeah. Hey, he took that. One. Yeah, he did take that one, huh? Chum and sand. Chum and sand. Oh no, the file fish is eating me. <laughs> there, you go. Oh, there he is. Man. Nice. Got him. Heck yeah, Renzo. Right. Yeah, he Coming up. Nice little yellowtail. That's definitely a keeper. There you go. Yeah. Nothing wrong with that. He's going to be 14. He's yeah, good. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he's good. Got him on. Oh. Oh, he just dropped it. Yeah. yeah. Damn. Hopefully I didn't break another hook. Which I did. I I'm up in this line. I can't do it anymore. Like I'm getting bites, but what the heck? All right, we're going to 20. These mangroves, ruthless, sharp teeth. Mangroves and turtles. <laughs> turtles. Been seeing some big turtles today. Renzo's got a nice one. Is he sliding or digging? Yellowtail, baby. Now, 
Nah, if it's a yellowtail, you're good to go. If it's a mangrove with the teeth, then we might have a problem. Double hookup! Ah! Oh, damn! There he is. Oh, there's a shark. Is that a shark? No. Nah. Yeah. Big? Oh, yeah. Oh, great. That's a nice one. You don't even have to measure him. Hopefully, I don't get sharked. This is our mangrove. Oh, Definitely our mangrove. 20 pound, bigger hook. Come on. Please. Oh, it's a parrotfish. Oh, big cuda. Oh. Giant cuda. Can't see him. He's right there. Yeah. Look at the cuda. Right here. <laughs> oh, yeah. Dude, freaking parrotfish? Yeah, look at wow. that. That's wild, Holy huh? Holy crap. That's pretty. Too bad you can't keep can't these keep here. Them. They taste good, man. Almost out of battery. Time to fillet some yellowtails. Already got them up on the board right here. Slice behind the peck fin. Make an incision down by the tail and ride up that backbone. Just like that. You don't want to go through it. You just want to see those bones just like that. Come down below the belly, slice. There's your rib cage, so you want to go up and over it. And you just make your cuts meet. And you got your little fillet. This side is much harder when they get mushy and there's not another side. But make it work just like that. Just do not go through that backbone and you won't have any problems. There you go. Poked eyes for good measure. And off she goes. Time to skin. Keep that knife as close to parallel with the board as you can. Make a little cut, grab that skin, and just pull the skin. Leave the knife against the cutting board. And then you got nothing on the other side. Cut out the little bit of pin bones there. You're good for your bag. Time for the kitchen. Big old bag of yellowtail. Oh, and here's a sneak peek of next week's video. The freak is that? Giant King. Big old bag of tuna. Gonna be a good one next week. You better tune in. Here we go. We in the kitchen. It's lunchtime. As you can probably tell from the video, I was not able to make it out on the boat with Jake and Renzo. But Jake, being the stand-up guy that he is, Gave me some little bit of yellowtail that I'm gonna cook up today. One of my all time favorites, coconut crusted yellowtail snapper. Delicious. Never actually tried this recipe for myself, so we're gonna wing it. Ingredients, we got a little egg wash. We're gonna dip these fish into some breadcrumbs, coconut flakes, and I don't know, I picked up this stuff from Maryland, from Jimmy's. Pretty good, like seasoning. I might throw it in the breadcrumbs. I don't know what I'm doing. It just sounds good, so I'm gonna try it. Coconut, seafood, it's gonna be good. Let's get to it. All right, I'm about it. Give these breadcrumbs a little flavor first. If this thing would come out of there. Okay, there we go. Give these guys a little mix together, right? Like our breading. I'm gonna dip these fish in the egg and back into here and give these a nice coconut bread crust. It's gonna be epic. I'm pretty psyched for this. Let's do it. Take our, well, it's kind of turned into little pieces of fish, but that's all right. It's still gonna be equally delicious. Dip them in that egg. Got them a nice little base. And into the breading. You're gonna do this with all these. Let's, let's work efficiently right here. Not a lot of fish, just one, one person meal. Almost. 
almost there. About time to put these suckers on. I mean, look at that crust. See if we're hot enough. Give me a crackle, baby. Oh, yeah. Good enough. Gonna get the rest of these on. Again, it should only take a few minutes. Pumped. All done. Perfect golden brown. Eh, those might have been a little long, but that's okay. I'm gonna get these bad boys plated up and start feasting. Lunch for one. Let's see what we're working with here. Oh yeah. That coconut is so good on that fish. 8.4. Just overall solid, solid course. Thank you, Jake. Mm. All right, what's gonna do it for today? Well, we got a big key strip coming up. Be sure to tune in. Hopefully gonna be doing fishing, diving, all that stuff, all day long. So be on the lookout, lots of good stuff coming. Peace.